Hello friends, welcome back to Miss Ashley's Pre-K, right here in Miss Ashley's living room. How is everybody feeling today? I am feeling excited because it is a new week and we are learning about something new. Well, it's something we've kind of already learned about, but we're going to learn more about it. We are learning about the four seasons this week, and I love talking about the four seasons. If you know the four seasons, can you say them with me? Let's check it out. Winter, spring, summer, and fall. Remember, what's the other word for fall? Autumn. Very good, friends. Now, we are going to sort different things for all the different seasons because are they the same? Do they have the same weather? Nope. Do they have the same clothing that we wear? Nope. Can we do the same things in winter that we can do in summer? Nope. So let's figure it out. I'm going to hold up a card and you have to tell me where you think the card goes. Ready? Hmm. What season do the leaves change colors? It starts to get chilly. What season is that? Winter, spring, summer, or fall? If you said fall, you are correct. Good work, friends. What about snow? When does it get super cold and start to snow? Winter, very good, friends. Nice job. Now, when does the weather get super, super hot? Miss Ashley likes this season. And the sun comes out and it's very shiny and everything is bright. Do you know what season that is? Winter, spring, summer, or fall? If you said summer, you are correct. And the last weather one is rain. Hmm, it's been very rainy recently. Hmm, what season are we in right now? Hmm, I think we're in the season of spring. What do you think? You're right. So it is very rainy in the spring. Now, let's talk about what we wear in these different seasons. The weather is what tells us what to wear. Should we be wearing snow boots in the sun when it is hot? No. Should we be wearing rain boots when it is chilly and just a little windy? Not so much. So let's figure out where these items go. When do we wear a bathing suit? In the summer. Very good. When do we wear a raincoat? In the spring. Awesome. What about this very cool warm hat? In the winter time. Beautiful. And this is tricky. It's a jacket, but it's not a winter jacket. It keeps us a little warm when it is feeling chilly outside. So when do we wear this? Winter, spring, summer, or fall? Fall or autumn. Very good, friends. You are on a roll. The last thing we are going to do is talk about the different things that we can do in these seasons. Ready? When can we build a snowman? In the winter. When can we dig in the sand? Outside at the beach or at the park? In the spring. I mean, in the spring, in the summer. Sorry, friends. Wishful thinking. When can we rake the leaves? In the fall. Awesome. And last but not least, when can we water the flowers? In the spring. Beautiful job. See, friends? We sorted winter, spring, summer, and fall. 
You can do this at home. You can do it with cards like Miss Ashley did. You can do it with clothing. If mommy and daddy or your grown-up gets you a bunch of different clothing to sort, you can do it with different types of books and see, are they winter books, spring books, summer books, or fall books? Speaking of books, we're going to read a book now. It's called Hooray for Spring. We are in the season of spring, so I want to read a spring book. The author is Patricia Hubble. Remember, the author is the person that writes the words in the story. It's illustrated by Taya Morley. Taya Morley is the person that drew the pictures or painted the pictures. She is the illustrator. Sashley loves this book because it is very beautiful. Ready? Oh, look. Hooray for spring! Hooray for spring! I hop, I skip, I fly on my swing. Friends, who would love to go to the playground and go on the swing? Me. When they open back up again, I will be one of the first people to go on the swing. I sing a cloud song, I dance a leaf dance, I lie on my tummy, I talk to the ants. Look friends, the weather changes a lot in the spring. So the boy is enjoying the rain, he is dancing in the leaves that have started to grow, and he's checking out the ants. Because now the weather is getting warmer and the bugs are coming out. I leap a big leap, jump a dee jump. Look at the beautiful flowers. I watch for a rabbit, thump a dee thump. Some animals begin to come out more too because of the warmer weather. Spring tingles my fingers, it puddles my toes. Why do you think there's a puddle there? What weather happened? Rain, very good. It breezes sweet smells past my wiggly nose. Remember, bumblebees love flowers. Bumblebees, butterflies, hummingbirds, and they often come out more in the spring when the flowers start to grow. I run to my garden. I plant tiny seeds. What is he planting, friends? Tomatoes, beets, and can you see? Carrots. I wiggle with worm. I giggle with goose. I peek between bushes. I pretend there's a moose. He's being silly. I pretend there's a moose, but he's only a mouse. Scampering, skittering home to his house. I pick yummy berries, I lick lemon ice. Springtime is wildly, deliciously nice. Look at that beautiful dragonfly that's drinking his own nectar from the flowers while the little boy is having an ice pop. Miss Ashley loves strawberries. I twist and I twirl like a kite on a string. Now these boys and girls are swimming in what looks like a lake. In New Jersey, it's usually not hot enough for us to go swimming in the spring, but in some places it is. I'm swinging, I'm singing, I'm winging. To spring. Look, he landed in a pond with a goose. That's silly. The end. Now, after this video, you can go on Seesaw and check out Spring in the Woods. Spring in different places looks a little bit different. We don't live in the woods, but we also don't live in the city. So let's watch the video to see what it looks like. What animals do they see? What kind of weather is there? You can also watch the StoryBots video where they sing all about the four seasons. As always, miss you lots and love you bunches. Mwah.